Hey, what's up, everybody? It's SCD. Little Joe. Interview for our mixtape. This is the SCD and Lil Do interview. And promotion to the new online CD we're working on. Yeah, what's up, man? What's up is we're going to put like yeah. 7 to 10 videos out on YouTube. And those are going to be our promotional singles. Stuff that you can watch. If you like what's on the album, then we're going to put those 10 on a CD. And then include some more songs off the channel as a bonus. So the CD will be like a 22 song, 20 song mixtape. If you like it, send us your address through. We'll send it to you. We're definitely going to be sending out to, we're going to send out some copies to a few of you. So. Shout out to Locksmith, Lofty Goals. Shout out to that new champ of King of the Dot, Il Maculate. You know. And Fody. And be Fody, because we're going to throw some Fody too for this interview. It's going to be a long interview. You guys are going to be in for a good thing. But SCD's going to kick it off. Tell them about yourself. Tell them about myself? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, well, I'm working four days out the week. I'm uh, working for a winery. Uh, it's really cool. I get perks. I get free wine every now and again. Another perk is I get a, char a bottle of Charles Woodson's wine. It's called 24. It's really cool because the cork has his signature on it. The bottle has his signature on it. It's really dope. Um, taking care of my mom and chilling with the homies. SCD, TZ, t Rad, Beast Max. Shout out to Chit Chat and Grimace. Mikey, aka Mikey. That's me. That's about it. Just thriving, living life. What are your thoughts? Uh, just fucking working. Trying to get shit done. Fucking writing a lot. I've been thinking a lot about this mixtape, so I'm really putting my thoughts into it, really putting focus into it. I want to make this some, something good. I want everyone to love what's gonna go on. I want to, I want you all to know there's not gonna be no fucking up. I want to allow it. I absolutely refuse. We get it perfect, so we don't get it at all. Who are you listening to? One person is the man himself, Locksmith. Flawless, Real Talk, Immaculate, some Tupac, some Woody, some Ti, some Eminem, mixed with Bad Meets Evil, Yellow Wolf, Slaughterhouse, Hobson. A lot of people, man. Mac Miller. I've been doing a lot of changing, adjusting to my iPod. More music's going on there. New stuff that I've been listening to that's been coming out. Stuff that SCD showed me, like Sam Hunt. One thing he showed me, uh, he showed me Country Folks with Bubba Sparks and who else? Danny Boone and Colt Ford. Yep, yep. And there's a bunch of other songs and a bunch of other people. Just a lot of music, just in general, but mainly the ones Eminem, Locksmith, Immaculate. Uh, Woody, T.I., Hobson. Those are like the main ones right now. How's your life? Ha. That's a question for the that's a question for the ages, isn't it? How's my life? My life is alright for the most part. Uh I got some complaints, a few bumps in the road. Like I said, just trying to like figure out ways around them and just kinda, you know just fucking thriving you know uh, I guess some more shit I could say about life now that I kind of put some thought to it for a second uh, life sucks government's you know really kind of shitting on this I'm not really following the presidential election so I'm not voting for nobody as far as right now is concerned but y'all should vote keep the right to vote alive I shouldn't, you know, say nobody should vote, but I ain't really voting for nobody. Yeah. Goodbye, Trump. See you later. Go back to TV. <laughs> How about talk about that online CD? Oh, man. CD. How you feeling about the CD, man? I mean, come on. CD's gonna be epic. It's gonna be intense. A lot of emotion, crazy rhymes, hard bars. There's a few there's a few in there that's gonna make you guys really think. It's gonna take like second looks, maybe double takes at and be like, holy shit, did you really just say that? I mean I've been listening to a lot of battle rap too, so some of these bars are getting influenced by a lot of the people you see on like Grind Time, King of the Dots, Smack URL, uh, a few names off the top, Disaster, Rome, 
Thesaurus, fucking Carter Deans, Omaculate, even a little Pat Stay, Sharon, fucking Head Ice, Arsenal, Joe Nye, definitely fucking Joe Nye. Joe Nye is a beast. Joe Nye versus Gutta, Joe Nye versus JC, man's unstoppable. I think he's undefeated. All that to say? Suck a free boss. <laughs> Pat Stay fan. I, I got love for the dark side. Let's get Pat Stay. <laughs> so, yeah, a lot of that influenced this album and this CD of these videos and all this stuff. You know, I just realized? What? I've got CD in my name. You do? SCD. Oh, yeah. Sports Center Dave coming with the Temple Tappers. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, yeah, no, uh, the main concept for the album pretty much is that we're going to be using our buddy Pockets Beats. Every video that we do, every song that we put out as far as the videos that are going on YouTube will be done to Pockets Beats. Yeah, shout so, out Joshua Wilson. Find him on Facebook, find him on SoundCloud. There's also Too Sick. He's not gonna, we're not going to be using any beats from him this time, but he's got some raw beats. Yeah, he's you can cool. find him on SoundCloud. Under Serpent Productions, S R P E N T Productions. And he's wicked talented, by the way. Wicked. We got Mad Flows. You can catch him on the channel. He did a song with me and Grimace, aka Mikey. He's been he's been doing it. He's out there doing it, moving. Much respect. It's time for SCD. So SCD, tell everybody about yourself. Been okay, so basically, my name is SCD. I am 22 years old. I am 6'2, 260. No, like more like 270. I'm a big SOB, you know what I mean? Keeping it 100, yeah. Keeping um, it 100. Anyway, so I am working every day, mostly pretty much uh, at Pizza Hut. I make pizzas, yeah, I'm doing the everyday grind. Nine to five. Um, you know, just trying to be positive. I drive a 2007 Honda CRV. It's blue. I painted the grill black, so it looks sick now. Uh, a couple more modifications coming, and you know, just living life, doing my thing. It's all I can do every day. It's all anyone can ask for, man. Sounds cool. So, what are your thoughts, man, about everything, anything, and anything, everything? All thoughts, thoughts, are, thoughts are cool. My thoughts are great, you know. I uh, hope everybody's doing well. Gas prices suck. <laughs> you know, I mean, come on, three dollars for a gallon? Are you kidding me? Bring back a dollar nine. Yeah. Bring back a dollar. Put 97, some more cash in my 98, pocket. 99. People, come on now. And I'm sure everybody out there that's driving can agree with me. Gas needs to be cheaper, man. <laughs> But anyway, other than that, life's cool, you know, living in Napa, it's, it's nice, you know, it's cool. It's nice when you're able to drive down the road and you can see, like, pretty pretty trees and nice vineyards and, you know, everybody happy and stuff like that. It's nice to live in a town like this. So, man, how are you feeling? How you feeling about your raps? How you feeling about, you know, like, thoughts on your music? I feel better now, knowing that I'm not doing no more shenanigans. I'm being serious, because I want everybody to know I do enjoy doing this, and I'm not doing it for nothing. You know, I enjoy it. He got me into it, to be honest with you, back in the day. When we first started kicking it, I listened to his raps, and I'm going to be honest with you. I thought he was good. I'm, uh, you know, not biased at all, just because he's my friend. He's actually really good. He's very lyrical. If you actually pay attention to his stuff... He says some really lyrical shit in there. He really puts some knowledge into it. He really takes time and effort to make his presence felt. And I saw that and I was like, you know, I want to give it a try. And I'm glad I did. Ambitious as Ryers did very well. A song with no name did very well. We're trying to get back there again. Because it was nice. It was fun. It was like a it was like a big, big, big high for me. Fucking, we were out there in the garage right here, back behind you where that white light is, the doorway, and we were there till like five in the morning. Recording fucking ambitions is right here. That shit was crazy. The energy was nuts. It was crazy. It was good. So you're stepping your game up pretty much. Trying, trying to. to. Trying to be a little bit more serious. Yeah. That's cute. That's cute. All right. So tell us about the music you're listening to. Like, what, what's kind of influencing your, your mood these days? Okay. So um, I have been listening to a lot of West Coast rap. I like I like the stuff that the Bay brings out. I like E-40. I like Be Legit. I like uh, Filthy, uh, Jay Stalin, Ken Kendrick's cool, Kendrick's really cool actually, I'm really getting a lot of respect for him, The Game of course, 
Um, even East Coast rappers, you know, I don't really believe in the East Coast, West Coast thing. As long as you can rap and you, you, you're cool with your name and, you know, you're spitting the truth, it doesn't matter what side you come from. As long as you're speaking the truth, it doesn't matter. I'll, I'll support your stuff. Yes, sir. If I'm so. digging your music, I'm digging it. If I ain't digging it, I just won't get into it. It's just how it is. That's but it. Y'all are talented in your own ways. I can't hate on nothing. Yeah, I may talk a lot of shit in my raps, but in all reality, music's music. Keep doing your thing. And everybody can say this. When you get in the zone, fuck everybody. It's all about what you want to say. <laughs> and if people you. like it, whatever. If people don't, well, we got 968 views on one video. So apparently you're not arguing with us. So there you go. Yeah. Glad to say. Fuck you, critics. There you go. How you feeling about the how you feeling about the C D? Like what are your thoughts on the C D, the concept? How okay. you feeling like when I hit you up about it? You know, tell people, give us some in depth you okay. know, look. So I'll tell I'll tell you the story as far as I remember. I came over one night and little dude came up to me and was like, Hey, I have this idea, I wanna do this C D and I as soon as I heard that I was like, dude, I'm down. Like I am so down for that, that would be so cool. Just to be able to like play my own my own music in my car. I mean that would be cool. We're gonna send it to a couple people that have been supporting us, and hopefully we, you know, we get our names out that way. I'm not trying to be big by it. I just want people to know what I'm saying. You know, as long as that, I, as long as I, even if I don't get any money for that, that would be cool. You know, just for people to walk up and be like, hey, that rapper would hit me, man. Thank you. That's all I need. And as soon as Mark came up, little dude came up to me and was like, uh, you know, shout out to Mark, the real me. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you know, as soon as I heard about it, I was just like, dude. It's t this is the perfect chance for me to steer away from my stupid bullshit I was saying. And, you know, really speak real and really be mature. Because I'm trying to grow up, you know. I've been learning a lot of lessons from him, from TZ, from my girlfriend, Alyssa Antonini, double A. Double A. And, uh, you know, I've been really learning a lot and I need to appreciate the people that have been brought in my life. God, God works in mysterious ways, I believe that. And I'm just blessed to have this opportunity with my best friend, Mark. AKA will do, AKA Mr. Too Cool for you. Right. <laughs> so, so anyway. All right, so here's here's what's else. Last extras that we kind of left out and didn't get to. Um, it's going to be about seven to ten tracks of new stuff that are going to be put on videos to Pocket Beats. And the rest of them, like I said, are just going to be some of the MBR songs that we've had over the past you know, few months since SCB started rapping and MBR was a thought. Uh, we're going to throw some extra songs on there, make it a full CD for you. We don't really got any details on the name of it or anything. There's not going to be like any real big artwork, although that would be dope. Uh, we're not going to do that. It's just going to all just fit into little CD cases, and we're just going to hand them out, send them off. And if you like them, slap them, show them to producers, show them to people, share us around. We just want to get our name out, I guess. Like he said, he's not really looking for fame. I'm not chasing fame. This is just an everyday hobby. Something that I enjoy doing is something that I'm getting better at, obviously. Definitely showing improvement or trying to. Uh, so, that's about it. We really have nothing more we can really say. We're not going to let, you know, give away too much. But when we do figure more shit out, we'll do another interview. Put it on YouTube. And? And? Our first video for the song will be uploaded shortly. That's right. It's a war on YouTube because we uh, we've been getting jacked views from YouTube. The ad, you know, the administers or the admins or whatever they're fucking called. You know, little computer guys that sit there and track YouTube. We've had like three videos now where our views skyrocketed up or went really high, and then the next day views were gone. A few people told me that they got glitches in the system where I guess like you hit the link button a couple times, it'll count more views than it should or something. But either way. Somebody's jacking views here, and I ain't trying to have that. That's fucked up. That's messed up on all kinds of levels. This is just music for everyone to hear. Not really hating on anyone. I mean, like I said, we talk a lot of shit, but it's for the love. It's for the sport, you know. P I W A, right? P I W A. Public issue with an attitude. The YouTube admins diss. Yeah. Coming up right after this interview. Stay tuned, it's gonna be pretty good. We're gonna take our time, we're gonna really get this video something, we're not make no mistakes. We hope y'all enjoy it. We urge y'all to keep watching and stay up. Have a good weekend. You too, I mean, uh, thank you. Thank you for all support. Everybody have a good ass weekend. Be safe. Peace. And we'll see you soon. Later.